With each of our RJ45 outlets, you'll also receive a cap that's used when terminating with multi-tool or 110 tool, a cap for toolless termination, and a cable tie. The first step is to prepare the cable for termination by removing at least 40 millimeters of the sheath to expose the pairs. Bend the pairs away from the central separator and then with a pair of side cutters, trim the separator back. First, we'll go through the toolless termination. Bunch the pairs back together and thread them through the toolless cap. Now untwist the pairs and then secure each wire into its correct colour coded slot. Repeat this with each pair until all the wires are in their correct slots. Then with the side cutters, simply trim each wire. Grab your outlet and just making sure the colour coded slots in the cap and in the outlet are matching up. Clip the cap onto the outlet. It'll make an audible click and then secure the closing pieces shut. If you are going to use a multi-tool or 110 tool to terminate, use the alternative cap. You've already prepared the cable by trimming the central separator and untwisting each of the pairs, but this time you'll place each of the wires into its colour-coded IDC in the outlet itself. Place the outlet in the tool to trim the wires. Straighten the cable up and clip the cap into place and secure the closing pieces shut as before. For either method of termination, it's a good idea to further secure the closing pieces of the outlet using a cable tie around the base. The cable tie goes around the hard plastic rather than the cable, so it's safe to use in this way. <laughs> 